What's up guys, this is Coach Ray and today we're going to do high cable pull down. So I'm going to use this handle, if you have two separate ones, no problem, if you don't have pack grips, no problem. So when we look at the armor sling and basically how our body works, we cannot do just normal full range of motion exercises. I think they will benefit the armor sling. Of course, you should do them sometimes, but when you're training specifically for armor sling, those will not work. You will uh, not get the benefits that you want. When you're doing this exercise, the correct way, for, not for arm wrestling, but just correct way is to put your shoulders out, put your shoulders back down, elbows to your sides, sit straight, squeeze at the bottom, and slowly let go, full range of motion. Release your, release your shoulders, so you get four range of motion. For arm wrestling, again, you're working from this inside. So, you're doing like this, and we're just gonna tweak it like this. So, I like to use the fat grips on my handles, and I like to turn my wrists a little bit inward. I will, uh, sometimes I will do cup grip, sometimes I will do the thumb on the other side. So, like this, sit straight, and then a little bit lean back. And try to pull your elbows down in front of you, and like this. Don't go full range of motion, just like this. So again, you're working inside arm sling out. So you're working inside arm sling angles. So your back is working a little bit of your arm, your elbow flexors are working, your wrists are working. So all the things we need to get better at arm sling. So this is the variation we use when we train specifically for arm sling. We will mix it up and we'll do full range of motion. We will do arm sling version. It depends on where you are at your training. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and see you next time.